Oops. I just pulled my webcam down. Uh, does it still work? Oh, uh, just a second. Yeah, it still works. What up? Seems like it's not coming out. Uh, Ian said release the week of the 15th, not the 15th. Well, no, like, let me look and see what this says. Okay. Um, so, uh, Wowhead. I'll pull this up and we'll see what they say. Okay, so, D Dire Steed and Dread Charger, uh, Quest Mount, Quest coming with Dire Maul, uh, World of Warcraft pop-up book, wow! Kill Jaden, oh yeah, I saw this, look at this shit, man. So this is the original Warcraft 3 models, look at them. They actually look really fucking good. Like, straight up, I think these look really fucking awesome. Like, I, I, <clears throat> that's, that's Archimon right there. <clears throat> I don't know who that's supposed to be. Who's that supposed to be? It's a zombie. Oh, there's Asgore with his massive fucking hammer. Uh, I didn't know Asgore had a hammer that big, but okay. Uh, you've got the uh, the fell hounds right there. Not really a big deal. Kill Jaden. Dude, I never knew Kill Jaden was so beefy. Like, I always thought of it in, in like, my mind. I thought Kill Jaden was, like, the cunning one. He was, like, the sneaky roguish uh, uh, guy. And, and uh, Archimon was, like, the general. And Magtherodon was, like, the big beefy motherfucker that just beat people's asses. Like, that, that was always, like, my thinking about it. But, uh, you know, it could be this, too. This is fine. There's still another seven hours? I don't know when it is, man. I have no idea. Oh, there's Magtherodon right there, I'm assuming. I, I think that's Magtherodon. He's got his little pike. Yeah, yeah. <coughs> that's Magtherodon. And then, oh, there's Man- Oh, Manoroth. Yeah. Manoroth is the badass. Like, I think that Manoroth is more powerful than Magtherodon. I don't remember it exactly. But, uh, that's what I remember in the lore. Uh, maybe I'm wrong about that, though. Uh, same as the Protoss and Zerg unit frames. Well, they obviously, like, Warcraft 3 Reforged, right, guys? I mean, let's be honest here. Warcraft 3 Reforged is basically StarCraft with Warcraft skins. You know, like, or, uh, like StarCraft 2 quality. Like, this is basically what it is. Like, a lot of these models and the way they're designed remind me a lot of StarCraft 2. And, uh, it's like, obviously, that's what it is. And, like, they're probably using a lot of the same stuff that they use for StarCraft 2. Oh, wait, there's Saffron. Wait, but he's not dead. So this is this is Saffron that's actually alive. Wow, that's pretty cool. Nah, actually, you killed him in Warcraft Three. See, this is all like I only vaguely remember this. I haven't played the game in so long. I don't remember. Uh, okay, human unit models. Look at this. Uh, where's Arthas? All right, let me look over here. So the Blade Master right there. I like that a lot. That's pretty cool. <clears throat> Barseer, Torin Chieftain. I always thought, didn't, I thought the Torin Chieftain, like, smash people with, like, their, their totems. Maybe I'm wrong about that. It's been so long. The, yeah, Torin Chieftain, Shadow Hunter. That's pretty badass. Demolisher, Grunts, Headhunters, Kodo Beast. Let me scroll down here and see if there's any more badass, uh, badass. Oh, no, it's these guys. That's what I was thinking of. These are the Torins. And they would, like, just destroy things with these fucking massive logs. And just be like, yeah, I'm gonna take this tree. And I'm gonna fucking hit you with it. That's basically what these guys used to do. And, uh, the Witch Doctors as well. I don't remember even what those were supposed to do. Alright, Human Unit Models. This is a Blood Mage. See, these guys right here, I always wish that they did something like this with Warcraft 3, you know? Or, sorry, World of Warcraft. Like, they used the model that these guys were doing, and, like, kind of the way the class and, like, the unit was designed. And they build a class off of this. I feel like a Blood Mage would be really, really fucking badass. Uh, Arc Mage. This is basically, like, the Antonidas guys. Not really a big deal. Uh, Mountain King. This, these are the Muradins. Uh, that, that's basically what it is. These are the Muradins. And uh, let's see, what about Paladins here? Yeah, these are basically the Paladins. These, these are the Arthuses with the massive fucking hammers. Uh, the units, Dragonhawk Rider, Footman. Ah, uh, you know what? I mean, the Footman, it's, like, it's such a basic unit, right? But I feel like they did a really good job putting it together. Like, this actually does look like a really, really badass looking Footman. Like, let me see. McConnell, you seen any of this Warcraft 3 shit? What? You seen any of this Warcraft 3 shit? No. You don't care about Warcraft 3? No, I just care about uh, getting funneled loot and raids. Well then why do you want to play Horde? I told you I like Shaman a lot. But yeah, you've been playing Paladin for 12 years. And it's garbage. So Shaman. Shaman's less garbage. Really? Okay, let's, let's pull up walks. Let's find out. Three, reforge. 
charged. Okay, so yeah, there it is. All right, Firefox. Okay, images. Where are the pictures here? Uh, wait, where's the unit? I'm not seeing it anywhere. Was it on Wowhead? I guess maybe it was. Fuck. Uh, let's see, Wowhead. Okay, let me pull this up. Arthas. All right, this is it. So there's Admiral Proudmore. That's pretty cool, right? That's the guy that uh, Jaina betrayed. That's her dad. Uh, and uh, Antonitis. That's Jaina's uh, mentor right there. The, uh, you know, badass Archmage. Arthas with Frostmore, dude. That looks fucking badass. Like, straight up, that looks badass. So what do you guys think about that model, man? Uh, I, this is a genuine question. Like, what do y'all think? Uh, me, personally, I think it looks really, really cool. Uh, it looks Soul Calibur. It does have kind of a Soul Calibur vibe to it. Uh, it does. I love... You know what I like the most about this? is the fucking cloak. Like, I don't know. Like, Blizzard needs to add armor like this into the game. Because it feels like the armor that they have, and, like, the way the character models are set up, there's only so much they can do. Like, there's like every cloak is the same. Every helmet is the same in a way, right? Shoulders a little bit different. I like what they've done with chest pieces though. Recently, uh, you know, with like the like the more 3D chest pieces, that's cool. Same with belts and legs and boots. But like cloaks, they just don't do shit with cloaks. And cloaks are like, I mean, look at that cloak. That cloak is badass. And then here's the uh, the blue art. It's basically the same thing, right? And then you have Red Arthas with the hammer. So this is actually Good Boy Arthas. And what I like the most about this, you guys might not notice this, but like you look at his, uh, uh, what do you call it, his hair. His hair turned white once he turned, uh, once he got Frostmourne. So basically being, having Frostmourne is being like the, uh, the president of the undead. You know, you know, like every fucking president gives white hair after they fucking get elected. That's basically what happened with Arthas too. It's the same thing. It's like Thor, uh, maybe like Thor too. Yeah, and so, yeah, this does look really, really good. And there's Muradin right there. I feel like, I mean, they really buffed Muradin's beard. Like, I, I've, I've, played, I've, played this, I've played this game before, okay? Like, Muradin's beard is not that big. Like, it, it's really not. Like, this is insane. Like, this is it's a massive fucking beard. Like, he got a huge buff on his beard. Uh, so where's your frost one? Yeah, listen, dude, I don't have white hair yet, okay? Hopefully it will stay that way. Uh, yeah, anyway, so Muradin looks badass. Jaina. I, let me, I'm going to zoom in on her boobs. Give me a minute. No, her boobs are bigger in the original game. 100% they were bigger. Like, let me look. I, I guarantee it. Like, trust me, guys, I know. Okay. Yeah, 100%. 100%. Like, at least three cup sizes. No, no, trust me. Like, yeah, this is... No, no, this is... Th th that... It's not the same. Trust me. Like, guys, it's not the same. I can guarantee you that. Look at that right there. Okay, there's Warcraft 3. Okay, um, view image. Oops. View image. Look at that. Way bigger. Way fucking bigger. Like, way more cleavage. A hundred fucking percent. They nerfed Jaina's boobs. There are some things, guys, we just can't stand for. Okay? And and this is just... This is too much. This is just too fucking much. Uh, yeah, they nerfed it. Nerf for... It's just a push-up bra? Maybe it is. But listen, like, I mean, and she's got, like, abs and, like, everything. Look at Jaina now. Actually, yeah, it's about the same. Okay, that's okay. Yeah, but I, I, I feel like she was hotter in the original. Like, comparatively... Uh, I thought she was way hotter in the original. I know that sounds really stupid because it is, but uh, yeah, I thought she was way hotter. Okay, let me see here. What are the other uh, other models we have to look at here? Jaina, Kale Thos. The Kale Thos model actually looks really good. Damn, look at that. That looks really badass. What do you guys think about this? Yeah, this looks really really good. Uh, Jaina fucked up, dude. She should have dated Kale Thos, man. Like, Kael Thos, well, Kael Thos went crazy, too. Actually, you know what? Has there ever been somebody that Jaina dated that things didn't go terribly wrong for? I mean, there's Arthas. I mean, need I say more? Uh, Kael Thos. 
You know, it's like if you're attracted to Jaina, you're fucked. But I mean, you, you're fucked. Like a thrall. Well, thrall. That's more like that. That's more fan service. Uh, what about uh, yeah, the fucking they tried to nuclear bomb Kale Ghost. Uh, Jaina is just one thing after another. Yeah, think about it. He lost his elements. Yeah, yeah, th yeah. I guess so. Kale still safe for now. Yeah, her father. Yeah, how'd that go? Uh, rather than do Kale Thus justice, I agree. Actually, you know what? Maybe, maybe not. It's hard for me really to say. She's dating God. I don't know about that, okay? And then there's Blue Kale Thos, which I think looks even more badass. Uh, yeah, I like the Kale Thos mod a lot. Medivh. Okay, let's see Medivh. Damn. So Medivh is just... Medivh's basically Metzen. Like, it is Metzen. Like, that's it. Like, that's, that's what Medivh's meant. Like, that, there it is. Uh, he's, yeah, he's Gandalf plus Metzen plus the, the staff thing, right? That, that's pretty much the whole thing. Uh, I like it. Uh, I think this looks actually pretty good. Uh, yeah, the whole model looks pretty badass. I like it a lot. Sylvanas. Okay. All right. All right, guys. Here we go. Holy shit. God damn. God damn, dude. Fuck yeah. Like, let me... All right, what's the original Sylvanas? Give me a minute, okay? Uh... Uh... Really not a lot to work with here. But... This is... Let me move it back over here. Yeah, I mean, this is definitely a buff. This is a 100% buff. Like, 100% fucking buff. Like, this is... You know what it is? It's because they're like... You know, a lot of people don't like Sylvanas anymore, you know, because of the whole uh, the whole situation with her being crazy and everything. And so they're like, how can we make players like Sylvanas again in Warcraft 3? I'll just make her boobs bigger. And everyone's like, that's my favorite character! Oh, wow! I love Sylvanas! She's awesome! That's all they need to do, okay? Uh, yeah, it's great. So, Sylvanas... I, I definitely approve of the Sylvanas... Uh, yeah, I mean, holy shit, dude. God damn. God damn, dude. Like, this is... Th this is great. Like, I, I feel like I'm... I, I really like Warcraft 3 or Forge. Huge tits are empowering. Of course they are, man. Hmm. Look at that, man. Yeah, Sylvanas is the best. What about the other ones? Okay, Uther. Let's look at Uther here. So, Uther looks like almost like... I, I kind of... I like the way that Uther looks, actually. I think it looks pretty badass. I feel like his armor is a little bit too... I don't know, it feels like it's not really from Azeroth in a way. It's like... Uh, I don't know how to explain it, but it doesn't really feel like it's like Azerothian armor. It feels like it's like crafted in like Argus or something similar to that. Uh, I don't know what it is about it, but it just feels like it's a little bit too... Uh, like Heroes of Storm model? Yeah, like almost... Yeah, like fucking Chaos Space Marine. Or not Chaos Space Marine, just Space Marine armor. Or like maybe it's from uh, Starcraft. It feels like it's more of a Starcraft model than a Warcraft model for Uther. Uh, let's see, what are the other ones? Okay. Uh, let's see the other hero models. Uh, which one is the Sylvanas hero model? Uh, I'm trying to remember. Is it the... Oh, fuck, I'm trying to remember this. Uh, Heroes 5, is it the, uh, Ranger? Is it Ranger? Okay. Let me see here, Ranger. Oh, uh, we have the demon models. I think we might not be able to see all these. Oh wait, oh, these are the Horde ones too. Okay, we've already seen all of these earlier. So let's see the Horde ones. Karen Bloodhoof. Damn. Dude, Karen looks like a badass. Holy fuck, he looks awesome. Dude. This is exactly what I would like to see. I, I don't, like, Karen Bloodhoof was always one of my favorite characters, man. Like, Karen was fucking amazing. I, I really, really liked it. I really, really liked this model. I think they absolutely did do him justice with this model, right? And he's even got the axe that he has in, uh, in like, Warcraft, original Warcraft, right? Chin, okay. Uh, okay, okay, all right. I don't want to get too into this. I, listen, we already know how I feel about this whole, uh, this whole situation with, you know, pandas. So we'll just skip this, all right? Drek'thar. Damn. 
Dude, Drekthar was a badass. Holy shit. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah, Drekthar was a badass. God damn. Yeah, that's awesome. I, I like this a lot. Yeah, Drekthar looks like a badass. Gromosh Hellscream? Oh, shit. Dude, Grom looks awesome, too. I like that a lot. And there's Gorehowl right there. I, I like how, so, Grom in the lore, like, my understanding is, like, Grom in the lore wasn't this big, beefy boy. He was, like, a very, very skinny, cunning orc, right? And over time, they were like, oh, you know what? Let's just make him look like Arnold Schwarzenegger, you know? And that's basically what we've got now. It's just, like, this fucking massive bodybuilder, huge dude, right? Uh, no, I thought, he, I thought Grom was, like, more skinny and like thin uh maybe i'm wrong about that but i, I like the uh i like how he has gorehal here it's not really as overbearing and uh you know overburdening in the way uh, i like it a lot this looks badass i don't know what he's got on his hand though that's a little bit silly okay Grom gromosh fell okay this is fell gromosh oh wow that looks really nice see we need models like that in uh in in fucking in wow like the green gorehal that's awesome I don't remember exactly how Gromosh turned fell besides, like, obviously the Manoroth thing. Is this whenever he got all the stuff and he killed Cenarius? Yeah, I think that's how it happened, right? Is he got, like, all the... He got empowered and he, he killed Cenarius? Yes? Okay, I, I thought so. Uh, so, all right, so we've got Gul'dan here. Uh, Gul'dan's pretty much exactly what you'd expect, honestly. Like, I... I yeah, this is, this is Gul'dan. Nothing too surprising here. Exactly what I would expect. Yeah, this is Gul'dan. He's a little bit too hunched over, in my opinion. Now, Rexar. Uh, I like Rexar a lot. I think that Rexar... The best thing that I like about it... This is like a subtlety. But I like how they combine like the body type of an ogre and the body type of an orc together to give you Rexar. You know, he's like a massive fucking... I don't know, like... I don't know, like a massive like Russian dude almost. Like that physique. And he's also got the ogre markings on him. I feel like the combination between the two does a really good job well i know that it's because he's a torn i know it's because he's an orc and a fucking and an ogre i i get why but i'm saying like i like how they made that re represented in his character model i think that's really cool uh real con this is basically the uh the the troll guy i like his face mask a lot i think the face mask and the feathers and shit looks really really cool uh grom drake manoroth's blood twice i don't remember the, sec the second time but sure uh, either way, uh, this does look really badass. Yeah, that's is basically Zappy Boy uh, version 1.0. Semero. This is basically the Blade Master guy. I like this guy a lot. I mean, like the only Blade Master I remember from Warcraft 3 is Blade Master Jupiter. So I don't remember Semero. But uh, either way, I think this looks really fucking badass, man. Do you think they're gonna cancel Blizzard BlizzCon? Uh, yeah. You know what? There's this hashtag that was going around, and Blizzard's so terrified of it, they're gonna cancel their major event of the entire year, the trade show. Yeah, of course they will. Uh, so yeah, this does look pretty badass. I like this. And then now we have the uh, the literal god himself. There's the wall. Fuck yeah, dude. Fuck yeah, dude. I like it a lot. I think this looks, this looks pretty badass. He's got Doom Hammer right there and everything. Yeah, this is pre uh, pre Jesus Thrall. This is Thrall the War Chief. Yeah, he's fucking awesome. I don't know how I feel about having all the armor be the same, though. I, I feel like Thrall is a little bit more like... I don't know, it, might, it might be a little bit too, too, you know, too prestigious. But overall, I think that it looks pretty good. I don't like his face either, but it's okay. All right, it's Vol'jin, last one. Uh, how the fuck is... Dude, Vol'jin is... He looks older than he does in, the, in Vanilla WoW or BFA. Like, it's somehow Vol'jin has aged retroactively, like, 20 years. Look at his face, man. The guy's seen a lot of shit. I like the staff that he has. It's like the staff from ZA. Or, sorry, ZG. Yeah, it looks pretty badass. It's the face paint? No, because it's the... Uh, it's uh, the wrinkles in his face underneath it, man. Either way, I like the models a lot. I think what they're doing with Warcraft 3 Reforged is pretty good. Now, are you guys excited for Warcraft 3 Reforged? Let me ask that. Uh, how excited are you guys? How many people are excited for Warcraft 3 Reforged? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, what, what do you guys think? Okay, uh, like 30 years or nothing? Yeah, I, I think that I'm excited about it, too. Uh, will you play it? Yes, I will absolutely play Warcraft 3 Reforged. Uh, I'm very excited to do it, and I think it's going to be fucking awesome. 
Uh, now, I don't know really exactly how long I'm going to play it for, right? It's like, am I going to play it forever or, like, you know, a uh, long period of time? I think that I will probably do... I'll probably play through all the campaigns. I'll go through all the campaign stuff. And then as time goes on, I'll maybe do a little bit more. And do, like, some custom games or, like, some normal... Come on, man. Like, you're really going to do this shit to me? Uh, do some custom games or something like that. And I'm not going to, like, really invest a ton of time in a Warcraft 3 Reforged. I think it's going to be a fun game to go through all the uh, all the cinematics and everything.